Hey everyone, welcome back to the making of Miserable Mac 3. This is part 20, and in this episode we're back to working on uh, Mac and actually doing some animation with him. Uh, so in the previous episode we were looking at uh, how we were changing up the way that uh, his character's uh, facial model was, was constructed, uh, namely making it look a little bit better and also to make it a little bit easier to animate. Uh, allowing for a greater range of expression, as well as just uh, simplifying the process for me uh, taking the model as a whole and then putting it into animation. So today we're, we're, we are doing the animation um, that I had just previously alluded to, um, or at least part of it, uh, the very, very beginning of it. And so I touched about this on, I'll put a link up to the episode where I first started talking about this, but what, uh, what, we're, what we're doing in this episode mainly is because of the way he's talking in this scene, we're, we're adding some additional movement to the character uh, to allow him uh, to, to, to appear a little bit more lifelike, uh, not be as stiff, and to appear as though he has some uh, depth and control over his actions uh, as, as opposed to just being stiff and uh, maybe moving to the side a little bit here and there. We're going to be going in and adding further details uh, that weren't previously there. The uh, sort of where the sideburns are, those are going to be able to be uh, moved side to side to again to uh, emphasize sort of the depth of the character, uh, depth as in terms of uh, in a 3D plane. Obviously we're just simulating it, uh, but it comes out to be a pretty convincing effect, something that I'm at the very least proud of and, and excited to utilize more moving forward as we get further into this cartoon, uh, seeing more of that and seeing it um, sort of uh, add something that wasn't necessarily there uh, beforehand before I had the intention of implementing these uh, sort of animation tweaks. So I hope you enjoy the rest of the video and as always I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. To check out the rest of this series, or to watch the first and second Miserable Mac cartoons, click on the annotations or the link to my YouTube page. If you're interested in keeping up to date on my latest videos, consider clicking that subscribe button.
Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.